Good morning, friends. My name is Pradeep Rai. I own a Medin bookshop by the name of Whatnot, below Ponosi, Bank of Baroda. How are you folks doing? I believe some are enjoying this lockdown and some are don't because their livelihoods have stopped. Mine has not stopped actually. I am still opening my shop every day in the morning following the government regulations but business has been affected a bit quite a bit but I am not complaining because this lockdown is for the greater good for the sake of this country now people like me who are following this lockdown are thinking what people are doing out there yesterday a mob attacked the RAF and the police at Tikiapara in Kolkata, West Bengal. I don't know why they attacked, where they were provoked, where they angry. Of course, people are angry. Some people are really angry because no one wants to sit out at home because no one is enjoying. Some are, the pensioners are, the employees of state and central government are because they know that they are still going to be paid at the end of the month but we don't so my question is when will this lockdown end my theory is that when a state will have zero cases for at least a month then that lockdown can end but it's not a question of whether the lockdown will end in West Bengal or it should end in Orissa or it should end in Punjab the question is when will the lockdown end in India some people are saying that this would go on till the end of this year. I don't expect it this to be so long. I want this lockdown to end tomorrow, but then my saying doesn't happen out here. It's the government decision when this lockdown is going to end. But what we can do as normal citizens is help the government in maintaining a balance. Chaos is not going to be the solution to this problem. I know we are feeling really uncanny. Our kids could not go to school. Some are having online classes. My kid is not. Unfortunately, his school doesn't have the infrastructure. And I don't believe that a class 2 student needs online classes. I really don't believe that a class 2 student needs online classes. He is studying and I believe many kids like him is also. But the question is, what will happen once the lockdown is over? We are going to venture out in the streets. Buses are going to be overcrowded. Trains are going to be packed. But what happens if there is a single case out there which has not been diagnosed and that person roams around free among ourselves? I have said this in my previous video. That, that is the most horrifying thing I can think of. So my request to you people is stay at home, stay safe, venture out. Of course, you have to venture out for your daily groceries and essentials, but don't pass time on the streets. Stay safe, folks.